precise, fast, and delicate. This Iranian-made surgeon robot is now going to grab the forceps from human surgeons. Dubbed Sina, the cutting-edge system is a telesurgery robot that can be operated from hundreds of kilometers away. Its developers say the state-of-the-art robo-surgeon can carry out a range of operations seamlessly. Actually, this machine is designed to may perform all kinds of surgeries in abdominal cavity. Uh, pelvic and chest, including general surgeries. Sina has two main subsystems, namely a master robotic console at the surgeon's side and a slave robotic system that's connected to the patient. The two subsystems are linked through a 5G wireless network, which instantly transfers the surgeon's hand movements to these robotic arms. Surgeon robots not only obviate the need for surgeons to be present in the operating room, but they facilitate the process of the operation to a great extent, thanks to better maneuverability and higher precision compared to traditional manual surgeries. The development of the Iranian-made surgical robots began in 2006 after Iran tried to import an American robotic surgery system called Da Vinci, but U.S. sanctions blocked the purchasing process. This sparked the idea of developing the domestic version of Da Vinci, and as it turns out, it outweighs its American counterpart in many ways, says the Sina manufacturing team. Sina is now a celebrity robot. Its developers say the surgical system has made a name for itself in many countries. It is started uh, exporting to the Indonesia two weeks ago, which for the first time we performed a partial hysterectomy on a pig specimen, on a female pig specimen, uh, between two cities of Bandung and Yogyakarta, between two hospitals. We performed these surgeries over 5G internet and it was completely stable. Also, we have some negotiation with Russia to uh, transfer the technology from Iran to Russia. Having suffered crippling economic sanctions imposed by the West, Iran has looked at the bans as a tailwind for development rather than a barrier. This has best been manifested in the country's health sector, which has borne the brunt of the sanctions. Now, experts here say if it wasn't for the restrictions, this Hina robo-surgeon could have never stepped into existence.